In this video, we will cover how you can view and edit your menu items. Navigate to the Menus tab and select Lunch, for example. Here, you can review the overall structure of your menu by verifying the different sections. You can also review each item's picture, name, description, price, and tags. You can also view the average rating for each item. Please go over the entire menu to make sure all items are related to the right section names. For more details, click on the food item where you can change the item name and description. You can also change the menu section it belongs to, and if required, you can also add a new section. To add or change the picture, simply click it to upload a new file from your system. For price changes though, please notify us at support at and we'll have it done right away. The dietary and ingredients section allows you to select all the tags applicable to this item. Please note tagging is very important for customers to be able to find your food. So take your time to accurately tag the items and make sure you don't miss out on any of them. In the nutritional facts, you can enter the calories count for this item. And if you have a detailed breakdown of the ingredients, you can enter that as well. The options section shows all the modifiers that apply to this item. You can select the option groups that apply to this item from the menu on the left. You can also view or edit each option group. For example, the rice options shows that one item must be selected while the maximum a customer can choose is one. And it also shows the option names and prices. Finally, you can use the preview button to view how a customer would be shown this menu item. This is a great way to review all the changes by looking at the title, description, picture, and dietary tags. You can also see the modifiers and whether they are optional or required. To add a new item, simply navigate back to the menu and use the new item button. Enter the title, price, and description. Next, you can choose which section this item belongs to or create a new one if necessary. Next, you can upload a picture from your system. And please keep in mind that a 16 by 9 aspect ratio is required. And if you have any issues resizing, simply email us the files at support at and we will get it done for you. Next, select the dietary and ingredients tags followed by the nutritional information in case you have it. If this item needs modifiers, then go ahead and select from the list or create a new option group. To make this option group mandatory or required, simply add a value in the must select box. Otherwise, enter a zero to make it optional for customers. Next, enter all the option names and their prices. Finally, use the preview button again to make sure everything looks okay. If you run into any issues or have any questions, please feel free to reach out at support at or go to the help tab and submit your queries. Thank you.